Hi, this is Mark from National Instruments, and welcome to the third video tutorial of LabVIEW. Here we will discuss the concept of parallel processing. Parallel processing is when two pieces of code execute simultaneously within the same program. This has become increasingly important in today's world when multi-core processors are becoming more prominent. While this is difficult to do in text-based program, LabVIEW makes this extremely easy. I'll demonstrate with a simple sample program. While loops in LabVIEW, like text-based programming, are used to continually execute portions of code until a condition or set of conditions is met. To add a while loop to the block diagram, open the functions palette and navigate to the structure section. Click on the while loop icon and then click and drag to enclose the portion of code which you want to have in the while loop. This red icon is called the loop conditional terminal and controls whether a while loop continues running or stops running. We will control this while loop with this front panel boolean stop button. A second while loop can be easily added to our block diagram. This will allow us true parallel processing. When I click the Run button, I can make changes to my front panel controls, and those changes are reflected on my front panel indicators. Because these loops are totally independent, I can stop my top loop, but my bottom loop continues running. This can be demonstrated because the changes I make in my control are still reflected in my indicator. But for my top loop, if I make changes to the control, those changes are no longer reflected by the indicator. If I click the stop button for our bottom loop, our entire program can now end. Thank you for watching this third video tutorial on LabVIEW. If you have any questions on this video or any of the other videos, please post them in the NI First discussion forum.